But first, a resolution, a controversial resolution voted down by county council in Greenville County one week ago today will get a second chance. Yep. Fire resolution set before 2016, including an anti-gay resolution from 1996. A new vote will happen at a specially called council meeting tomorrow. 7 News' Ayla Farone joins us live from County Square with more on this. Ayla, fill us in. Well, Diane, supporters of that sunset resolution gathered here at County Square earlier today to urge people to come out to that county council vote tomorrow to show solidarity. But not everyone agrees with that sunset resolution. Allow Greenville to move forward. The community coming together to support a county vote that would roll back a decades old anti gay resolution. It's important that we let the county council know. Judgment and morality is not in the scope of your job description. Caroline Caldwell is the vice president of Upstate Pride SC and says leaving this resolution on the books is wrong. It's a statement of discrimination. It's a statement of ostracization. Um, it's a statement of hatefulness. Community leaders like UA Thompson coming out in support of the sunset resolution. This matter is likely to only get worse and cause greater divide and dissension in our community. Councilman and his fan supports the vote and says it would make the county more progressive. I tell county council all the time, either we're going to live in our grandmother's county, Greenville County, or our grandchildren's. But not everyone feels that way. The state's not doing that with antiquated laws. I don't see any reason why we would do that to resolutions. Councilman Joe Dale voted against the resolution last week, saying it would get rid of more than just the anti-gay resolution. It's like 1,300 resolutions. Some. Or, or not affect, you know, they're no good anymore. He'd prefer if they voted on the 1996 resolution specifically. If they want to get rid of that resolution, then they need to have that vote. Even then, he says he wouldn't vote in favor of that either. But Caldwell and others pushing for the sunset resolution say they won't give up on what they deserve. That we can walk freely, talk freely, love freely, and be free in the county and the city in which we live in. Now that vote will take place at 3 o'clock tomorrow afternoon right here in County Square. I'm reporting live in Greenville, Ayla Farone, 7 News.